Okay. Alright. Alright, got it on. Okay. Yeah, no, I got my body cam on. It's good. The guy in the blue shirt. I just got my photo taken. Today. Yeah, limit. Hey, what up, dude? Good, man. <laughs> I thought we'd run into him. Antifa communist thing, and if they're going to act like a bunch of Nazis and have Governor Newsom enforce all these Nazi laws, then it is what it is. It's a peaceful protest. It's not. I'm not here. Not. I'm not, not here. Yes, I'm, I'm not causing a problem. I'm just standing here doing my shopping, not causing any issues. And if you don't like it, I could take the mask off. I would just like to take it off. Go for it, man. I'll take it off when I'm checking out. I'm not taking it off. It's my First Amendment right. There's no sign that says... I can't decorate my mask however I want. This is America. Land of the free. Hello, sir. How are you doing today? So, um, you probably know why we're here. No, I'm um, surprised, actually. So, I didn't. Um, they asked you to take that off because. Well, they told me to put it on first, actually. No, I know, because you have this, this, this part right here. Have so, they asked you to take that off. I told them I would take it off when I check out. I know, but then we have this whole thing with the whole face mask thing because of COVID-19. Well, I mean, it's just Velcro. I can just... So, are you willing to take that off? Yeah, I told them when I check out, I'll just take the Velcro right off. They, they're not allowing it in the store because if they, if it's a family-friendly store. They don't want people seeing that. It's offensive to people. Okay, well, this is a private store and they don't allow. So if you want to go do that outside, that's completely fine. I get it. But they're asking you, it's offensive in the store. It's just discrimination. Okay, but this is their private store. You can take it up with Food for Less Management if you want to at a later time. You or that? can I ask him? Can I talk to the Food for Less Management? I think you guys already talked about but I don't want another disturbance to happen with you guys. Do you have your ID on you? If you're not under like any kind of trouble or anything, we just want to document you. Sir. Hold on, I just want to pay attention to what they're talking about. There must have been some miscommunication between them and us and you guys. So they were under the impression that they wanted you to take off. So whether he tells you or we tell you they want it off, it's be in the store, you have to take it off. But once you go outside, you're going to the store. And if they, I think they said they offered you another mask. No, they off. didn't. Okay. They didn't offer me anything. They told me to put it on, and then they got mad at me. Okay. And I've been peacefully shopping with my oh, wife. I totally understand, but it's just it's their policy, the store. So I get it. It's freedom, like 
uh, right to freedom of speech. And all yeah, that. it is. Um, but in a private store, they can make their own rules. They can enforce whatever they want. And right now, it's a faith path, and that's offensive to them. So, um, do you have your ID on you? I do. Can I see it, please? I'd, I'd like to decline. I mean, I'll, I'll take right it now, off if that's right a thing. Now, based on what they told us, that they asked you to leave, too. Because they didn't. That. So they said, are I asked them, right? They so said, they said you could. Let me see your ID, and this can be a lot easier than you need to be, okay? Because then we can arrest you for trespassing. There. Are they happy now? I need to see your ID, too. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. I don't have my ID. She has it. Okay. Let me get your ID. First answer. Dusty? Yeah, what's your address? I can look it up. I don't want to answer any more questions. You right said now, you're detained, so what do you want to do? You want to make this harder than it needs to be? This is just this is just a document that was. Hey, you never said anything. anything. You said you, we were just going to document the you incident. Understand with this incident, what that happened at Vaughn's, take, they take it very seriously. What happened at Vaughn's? There's a person that wore a hood. And I There's a person that wore a hood at Vaughn's? The KKK hood. Okay? What the fuck? So, this, they're taking I don't even serious. watch TV. Okay. I didn't know about some. Alright. So that's why I just want to get your information, talk to you, and then we're good. Okay. Well, you can have that information. That's all you need to get a hold of me. I need to look at. I, I don't know how many dusty hearts are in the world. I don't know either. So, if I have your address, it limits, it narrows it down to what I can look. What is your address? Sir? 1 Santee, California, 92021. Or 92071, sorry. Um, so as long as you have it off, he's fine. Okay. Uh, I told I'll, him I would have no problem taking it off when I was working with his employees. Okay. I will talk to him and let him know that you were willing to take it off. And when you're outside the store, you're free to do whatever you want. But because this is a private institution. I'm not free to do whatever I want. We live in a state and we have a Nazi for a governor. That's the whole problem. Okay. It's a peaceful protest against the governor. I That's understand. the whole thing. I'm not going to get And now you right guys now. are here, like, literally proving my point. Okay. I know. Like, we're getting like, a call from this business because of a customer causing a disturbance because of an offensive symbol that is on his face. Right. Like, well, I see the LGBT flag, and that's offensive to me. I don't okay. get to call the cops. Then if it's offensive to you, you guys don't break down their doors. You, then you can call us, and we'll do the same thing. Okay, sir? I'm sure you will. Okay. Have a great a day. Too. Can I put my flag on for a picture? No, sir. Why I mean, not? If you want. That's yeah. Cool. That's good. Good. And then we can do a before and after. Okay. So this will look like when you approach me. Sure. I appreciate it. Yeah, take it off. You take, that, you take this part off. Again. No, I mean, you just told me to not take it off. We do this, and we're out of here. Okay. It's that much easier. Okay. If you have any questions for us, I will go talk to the manager and let him know that you're going to take keep that off. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. And if we get a call that it's back on, then he's going to ask you to leave again. And then it's I'm going to put it back on. I've proven my point. I have my body cam, and okay. it is what it is. And then if Thank that you happens, for doing your job, and let's all have a great day. All right, I get it. That's right. I'm just letting you know. If we come back, and then it's a trespassing No, it's issue, not. It's not any problem. I got exactly... You're under arrest for trespassing. Okay. okay. Well, we're all good. Okay. I proved my point. You have everything? Yes. everything? All right. So, any questions for me right now? Can we just... Say our badge numbers and names for the video. Uh, K Belzer and okay. 0313. 0313? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, have a great day. All right. Because, like, I can't even breathe with mine. Like, I have anxiety. I have, like, anxiety problems, right? Like, I have anxiety issues. Yeah. And, like, wearing this is, like, really triggering my anxiety, like, really hard. Like, I, I hate wearing it, too. It makes, it makes, it makes my face break out. I yeah. hate it. And, look, I get this wave. I know. I it's get like it. days. I get it. And I understand your whole point on the governor and all that, but I'm, I can't get involved. I know. Yet. It's not your deal. So, I'm just telling you so you understand. Okay. I'm not here promoting some Nazi propaganda. Okay. I'm here peacefully protesting against the governor's insane lockdown orders. Because okay. I would like to go back to work. But all I get to do is sit at home and fester. I like, it. I want to get out of my house and go work and be productive. But private stores have private policies. Oh, I'm not talking about that. I'm not worried about that. I'm just telling you why I'm doing a peaceful protest. And that's all it is. It's not some guy in a KKK hood going around promoting the Klan. Okay? It's a guy peacefully protesting the governor. That's it. Yeah. No, I'm not arguing with you guys at all. I'm not arguing. I'm just... This is proving my point. You know? I'm not causing you guys any problems. 
I'm not going to get riled up. We're just going to continue shopping and be done with it. Cool. All right. You too, sir. Have a great day. So I guess I don't have to wear it now. They didn't tell me I could put it back on. And that's America. I'm glad we made him cry. They said we would be okay if we took it off. We weren't trying to offend anyone. Yeah. Nothing personal against you. I've been stopping here a long time. I recognize you. We grew up in the same neighborhood. Thank you for persecuting me for my Hindu religion. Like, yeah. Oh, now like five or six, probably seven, maybe. This is rules. Got everyone in quarantine going crazy. You guys are lucky to get out of your house. You got jobs and shit. Yeah, bro. 